Travel west from the Lake of Songs until you find the Twin Falls, then follow the Lonesome River upstream to a pass between five mountains. If you wait till nightfall, you will see the lights begin to sprinkle across the valley, for this is no ordinary place you have found, but the fabled Library of Shadows. Seth travelled alone this night until he came to a place where the road swept round to the left which ended in complete darkness. He knew this place. In front of him stood a house. The light through its windows picked out memories, stories, perhaps something more important. Seth had been here before. In a past dream, he had walked this path and entered this house before. He followed the dark corridors up in the spiral staircase to a place they called the Library of Shadows. Scanning the shelves, one book stood out to him. A feeling, a memory. Three-headed leopard. What does this mean? Before said stood a shadow, a memory of something, perhaps a story which he had forgotten. The shadow asks Seth, "Do you remember me from your dream? You know you've been here before." The shadow explains to Seth. I've brought you here for a reason. Each page in each book in this library contains stories about our lives. Our souls are trapped inside these books. Do you remember reading your story, Seth? These stories are what trap us inside this building. Seth replies, but why am I here? Have you seen the symbol? The three-headed leopard? That's your family symbol, Seth. You need to grab your book and leave this house to free your soul from the library. Seth searches for his book, his soul, his family memories. The walls start to shake as Seth leaves the house. left is a happy memory in time.